language or perception. Advice to the child of a dysfunctional family. Your parents make mistakes. It was not because they failed to love you. It was because their past perceptions interfered. They had to learn on their own, as you must. They will have regrets. You can spend your life hating them, blaming them for everything wrong in your life. Remember, you can't change the past, and the only person you can change is yourself. Every day, past, from when society declares you an adult, should lead you to become stronger, more independent. Eventually, an excuse is worn out. You can use it forever, but you will never be happy, and most people that do learn would just assume you go away. Until you realize it is your life you are messing with, you will not progress. You still allow them power because you are unwilling to embrace your life. Make of it what you will. Even mistakes, no matter how hard, can teach you how to be a better person. Let them own the mistakes. You own the future. Don't hate them. It serves no purpose. Except that they were doing the best. That it's possible they were broken long before you were born. And remember, God is a God of souls. He did choose to place you with the persons that he did. But this is a huge project. And it could be lessons you learn from the pain on earth might be a source of strength into adulthood. If you learn from it. You will struggle, but in time, if you stay humble, focused on the future, then it could be you might someday understand if you like who you are today. You should remember it was the painful lessons that taught you humility. To change any part of the past would change you in ways you can't imagine. Those people you see that you can't stand, that could have been you, except your language or perceptions gave you a whole different outlook on life. Embrace that. Let them own the past. Your parents I'm talking about. You own the future and make it the best it can be. You will make mistakes. Just make sure you repeat the old ones less. And you will find strength in knowing the person you are today is the person you want to be. Couldn't imagine being anything else. That's when you have gained the wisdom needed to start a family that you can nurture. Just because you can make a baby does not mean you're ready for one. If you act without thinking, consider yourself a savage and capable of controlling your body, then you could make a child. That is not your parents' fault. It is not your partner's fault alone. It took two to make that child, and that will tie you together for 18 years. Once you create that child, Understand, you no longer have the right to the fun life you could have had. Your parents failed to understand that, and that is why they made so many mistakes. If you are incapable of learning that, then the child you create will have no better a life than you had, because their parents will be learning as they go along. Making different mistakes, but still mistakes. Child rearing should not be learned on the fly. It is not supposed to be on the job training. A mistake with a child lasts a lifetime. Once that child is born, they are the priority. And we all have the ability at self-deception. Telling ourselves it's really for the good of the child when in fact it's just good for you. And they are along for the ride. That is selfish. And your child will have as little respect for that as you did when your parents did it to you. Never forget the lessons of how you felt as a child when raising your own. It will help you talk to that child when they start asking why. Remember the moment your parents started to fail you 